could spread like wildfire among our communities. Dr. Edgar Chavez with troubling news about the UK variant now present in Pasadena. That is very concerning, especially if now we have this uh, B117 variant that can spread a lot more easier uh, among populations. <laughs> And the B117 variant hits just as spring break begins, when large gatherings will likely spike with crowds that may not follow safety guidelines. Where people now are going to go out, possibly not wear their masks, not have social distance, when we should actually be preparing potentially for a fourth wave of coronavirus that may or may not happen. But again, it's something that's a possibility. The person infected with the variant in Pasadena is identified only as an adult, and it comes just as L.A. County enters red tier status. It doesn't take an expert to see that people might be lured into a false sense of security. We have to be safe because just as much as everyone else, I want to get back to my normal life just like everyone else does. But, I mean, yeah, it's worth it just to, you know, be precautious and save someone else's life. This is still very serious. Things are still happening. We need to keep keep each other safe, you know? Ideally, that's the kind of attitude health officials want everyone to have. The more realistic view is that as things begin to open back up, the more people will think that the worst is behind us. Things are opening up. People feel a sense of security going out, being in crowds, potentially not even wearing their mask. And so I think that that's the wrong attitude right now. And back with you live, giving you another look at these message boards that you'll see around Pasadena. Health officials stress that we are not anywhere close to being out of the woods. They encourage people to continue washing their hands, wearing masks, social distancing, doing all the things that have gotten us this far, gotten us into the red tier. Susan, as you know, there's an old saying, you dance with the one that brung you. Well, the dance in this case belongs to all the social protocols, the health uh, safety protocols that have gotten us back into the red tier. And uh, health officials want people to continue doing those things. We're live in Pasadena. Rick Lozano, Fox 11 News. Absolutely, Rick. But meantime, we are at spring break, and there's a lot of people that are anxious to travel. Is that a good idea? Well, it's not going to get anybody in trouble, but uh, health officials will tell you that if you do travel, and people are going to travel, of course, if you do travel in-state, when you return, just get retested. And if you travel out of state, same thing, get retested, but also you need to self-quarantine. That's a mandate, self-quarantine for 10 days. Susan? All right, Rick Lozano.